Hello friends, welcome back to my channel and you are watching Share and Learn with Jadin. Hope so you are doing well and safe. So first of all, if uh, you you have not subscribed my YouTube channel, so subscribe here, uh, subscribe today and now right now. And uh, please like the video if you find beneficial for you and please share with your friends so that they can get the benefit of the same and uh, comment your views uh, and like the videos because uh, I noticed that uh, you don't do not like the video but you watch the video. So this is not good so please like the video and comment your views and don't forget to subscribe my youtube channel so yes this is a vacancy which is in edcil india limited this is basically a mini ethnic category 1 cpsc and government of india so this is a uh, public sector undertaking and for way of which registered office is situated at uh, barakamba road new delhi so in new delhi government uh, uh, New Delhi में जो ये vacancy है location of जो होगी आपकी जो location होगी आपकी working की वो Delhi में ही रहेगी advertisement number आपको जरूर quote करना you must quote your this advertisement number for your all references when you apply for the post after your application and जो last जो आपके advertisement की date थी that was 14th of March 2022 now we are discussing a relevant vacancy so this is a post code that is 105 and uh, the DESIC post uh, name is finance procurement and monitoring this is the name of your post and uh, total number of vacancy is one only and the essential qualification is uh, uh, mentioned there here that master degree in accounting or business you must have or you must have MBA in finance or you can also have if you are CA or ICWA right then you are eligible for this post so this is for uh, CEO or ICWA in short for a master degree in commerce or for um, MBA in finance right and uh, or relevant subjects may up you have with at least 60% on a from its recognized university and jo experience is me bola gaya hai the essential experience is uh, here he, they mentioned that experience um, that is essential so you must have at least 10 years of post qualification experience whatever qualification you are taking as your as base so after that you must have at least of uh, 10 years as a post qualification experience post qualification experience is basically means uh, the qualification which is uh, after that you have the experience for for at least of 10 years right suppose you have completed your ca then whatever you whatever experience you have that will be counted only after completion of your ca course that suppose if you have experience of uh, article jib or any kind of exp uh, experience which is uh, before clearing your ca or icw or M mba or mcom then that will not be considered for this vacancy so total years of experience you must have at least 10 years and uh, they have mentioned that that experience must be in the field of finance and procurement in school education and this is the essential experience essential criteria right now this what they have uh, in terms of desirable so person with the mphil or phd uh, that is additional qualification research experience published paper in the relevant field would be preferred so this is a desirable but not the essential essential is what you must have 10 years of post qualification experience along with ca or icwa or mba right now the uh, and total number of vacancy is going to be one right now what is the criteria for the for the next vacancy is finance and procurement this is uh, post code 207 and total number of vacancy is again here only one now what is the minimum qualification or the essential qualification you can say so there is a master degree in finance and accounts and business right they have mentioned or either you can also have CA or ICWA two years PG diploma in finance and management that is PGDM whatever you may call and with at least uh, must be 60 percent so they have not mentioned the percentage criteria with the ICWA or CA in previous job as previous vacancy as well and this is as well so 60 percent criteria only will, will, will be checking in uh, your degree which is uh, not CA or ICWA now here the essential qualification experience is essential experience essential qualification experience is required here around 8 years right 
eight years you must have your uh, post qualification experience in terms of uh, relevant uh, field of finance and procurement and again they have mentioned desirable experience right that is a person of mphil and phd now let's discuss the the next vacancy so next vacancy is postcode number 307 so total number of vacancies is going to be one and the and the post is your finance and procurement uh, now they have also mentioned master degree in business that means same qualification is uh, for uh, all the position which is i am discussing with you but uh, but the difference is that uh, year of experience is is, uh, is changing from vacancy to vacancy so this for this vacancy for the post code 307 they have they require only 5 years as your post qualification experience in the relevant field of finance and procurement right and addition and desirable experience so whatever you can have then it will be added added a value in your uh, job selection or the uh, application criteria that is your mphil or phd now uh, there were only three uh, three vacancy now the fourth vacancy is also here and that is a uh, post code 40416 and the post is your fin consultant finance uh, ex exemplar schools right now here is only one vacancy now the minimum qualification is same as in the previous three uh, vacancies but here the difference is that only year of experience so they have mentioned only three years of relevant post uh, qualification experience. If the candidate have, then he or may she, he or may uh, apply for the vacancy, right? So if I conclude that uh, there are four vacancies on only, and each vacancy has one uh, one post, one 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 vacancy, right? And minimum uh, and minimum qualification is same for all four vacancies, for all four jobs. But difference is that in first vacancy they have mentioned at least ten years as post qualification experience, and in second uh, eight eight years, and third is fifth year, and fourth is third year. Now there are some general instruction which they have mentioned that only you the application mode is going to be online. No uh, f uh, hard copy application will be allowed, and if you have if you are eligible for more than one one post, then uh, apply each post uh, for separately right so you have to apply for uh, each post only indian nationals are eligible and uh, consultants will be on full time basis and their pla their place of work will be in delhi new delhi only now whatever experience or qualification you have that must be uh, that will be check, uh, checked out by the uh, <clears throat> by the com by the company itself uh, it's on or before 28th of February 2022. So your experience and qualification, whatever they require, will be checked out on 28th of February 2022. Now candidate have to uh, have should have oral and written communication skill with the excellent working knowledge of computer, MS Word, MS Excel, and PowerPoint. And uh, last one is presentation skill. Now what is going to be the selection process? So selection process is, is to be uh, is to be done on the basis of your academic, professional qualification and experience, and after that uh, you may you may also have your uh, test of writing that is skill and group discussion or interview. They have mentioned that uh, will also include. That means it is compulsory that uh, you are going to face your written test along with your GDN interview. Right. So it will be depending all on the uh, on the number of application applicants received by the company itself. Right. So waiting criteria you can check from here. Now, so document to prove your qualification, experience, age, etc. have to be produced only when you are uh, going to be called for the uh, for the relevant test or writing of uh, discussion and and all. Now age limit uh, not more than as integrated against each post they have mentioned but whatever vacancy whatever post we have discussed they have there was not any kind of age limit right but your, that uh, whatever it may be will be checked out only on 28th of February 2022 right application fee about application fee they have they have not mentioned here 
number of posts they have mentioned and call letters will be uh, will be given to the person who will be shortlisted uh, and that will be communicated by email only right and your email id must be uh, must be in a working condition that means active right and uh, last date of application is uh, going to be 31st of march 2020 sorry this is not the last date to apply but for the last date to receive the application that means your application must be sent be on or before the 31st of march 2022 so that it can reach uh, before 31st of march 2022 or on 31st march 2022 so let's look on the official website of the company so this is basically i whatever i have written over here on the google browser that is edc edicl and i clicked on that uh, instead of clicking on the this tab i'm clicking on the recruitment tab this is uh, very important to know because uh, lots of people discuss the vacancy but they do not discuss that how to arrive at that particular website and uh, apply accordingly so this is very important point which you need to understand so click on career tab which will be available to you and after that click on the career at edcil right now this is the um, application link here basically uh, recruitment for the tsg product and recruitment for edcl so suppose i click on the uh, on, on both on all the three links then this link is uh, opening and right so that means uh, the first link is not going to work right so by going on the website we have uh, also clearly known that this is not going with this is not going to be the link right so as we have discussed this is for tsg project right so we click on that all link so yes this is the dashboard uh, where you can apply your for your post so for online application of uh, uh, whatever they have mentioned tsg group then we click here and this is the link for downloading the advertisement which i have discussed with you right so this is the website which i discussed with you now click on the uh, first link that is application link so this is the application link and uh, and this uh, as i have already mentioned you that uh, this post has announced on 14th of march 2022 and last day to apply for the uh, position is 31st of march 2022 right so register yourself against uh, 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 this portal suppose uh, i click on this link proceed to register right then it will be so yes it is opening and uh, yes it is saying that uh, select uh, uh, so yes so whatever for the position i i am applying i have to select post group uh, suppose uh, then my post comes under as consultant right then i need to select the tab that is uh, what post for what post i am applying right suppose i am applying for the consultant finance exemplar school right so i have to select that right suppose i am selecting for the another post then i have to select accordingly so this was the uh, so registration uh, dashboard and you can register yourself and then apply for the vacancy accordingly so thank you so much friend for uh, watching the complete video and please like the video and share with your friends if you if you, if any one of the friend of you can get the benefit of the same then please uh, subscribe my youtube channel thank you so much